Hey guys, it's Nadia from the Idea Designs and I'm back with another video. Today we're making some really quick and super cute cupcake sprinkle coasters. Now, these are always a fan favorite whenever I make them for art shows and things like that. The kids love them. They always think it's so cool to find out those are actual real cupcake sprinkles in the coaster. And um, so we're going to start off with some little molds. These are the same little molds that I use for my poker chip coasters. Um, so we're going, I only mixed up about four ounces of resin here because it takes almost two ounces per coaster. So we start off just by pouring about half of the um, coaster mold filled with the resin. And I added some iridescent um, sprinkles and that's optional, but I just like the little extra sparkle in everything that I make. So um, we only put a little bit at the bottom. It's about halfway so that we can first just make sure we're getting those um, little bubbles out first with the heat gun and then after that we're going to go ahead and we're going to add the sprinkles in um, This particular mix that I'm using is from sweet Apolita and it actually does have various different sprinkles in it so it's different sizes and shapes and and colors obviously there um, one thing that I have to be careful of and when I'm making these coasters and when I'm using a mix like this is sometimes some of the sprinkles are a little bit uh, larger than the height of where the resin is going to be. So I just need to make sure I'm going through and removing those. I've done that to some extent here, but I will be going through and double checking as I go along to remove any that um, might be too tall and uh, would be peeking over the surface of the resin when I finish adding the second, um, the top up layer, which I'll do after I flattened out all the, the, um, the sprinkles, which is what I'm doing here. So I'm just going to flatten them out, just trying to spread them out evenly, make sure that um, most of the gaps are filled up or at least it's evenly spaced out. And, um, and if there's any that are, you know, any colors that are really close together, then I, you know, pick those up and I move them about just to kind of, you know, get an even look um, throughout the coaster. So I'm going to do that first and uh, we'll go into a quick time lapse as I finish this up. So we're almost done here and what we're going to do is once we flattened out the um, the sprinkles and we think we're ready to go, we're going to add the rest of the resin that I, I mixed up here. And again, I use crystal resin, so it's a one to one. And uh, so I'll add the rest here and then we're going to go over with a heat gun again to um, just get those bubbles out. And once that's done, we're going to leave it overnight to get um, all set up and we'll be back in the morning to see the results. So it's the next morning and we're just going to get these unmolded. So this is the bottom and when we take them out, we'll flip them over and that's going to be the top. And they look super cute. So I love the sparkle in there, the iridescence. And you can see that the sprinkles are nice and flat and there's no uh, holes or gaps or anything like that. So they're pretty perfect. Um, I hope you guys like these and if you do, just please leave a like and a comment and don't forget to subscribe. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.